Mimi nilimwambia achana watu nimeenda wazimu ni nini wanatuambia? Na tukaendelea and tukaasiu mtu kila kitu. Na na chira atembeangi peke yake. Atembeangi peke yake. Trust you me hakuwa peke yake. Hakuwa peke yake simu yake kwa pizi meibiwa, bibi zilibiwa. Ujui kama ni accident, ujui kama aliwaa kagongwa kichwa, ujui kama ni accident. Muna mwili ngine je umia ni kichwa peke yake imepasuka. Muna kwingine hakuna match, kwingine hakuwa kwa sawa. Muna jagua ruzo ama kugua hata na barabara. What if ni hitan? Mimi mimi bibi sijui ya kile like, eh akida shosha yake shosha yake na mbivu akafi kai he was the only hope of that family and now he's gone at the age of 23 kai mimi tell the first thing nimefika nikamuombea what if it was a gunshot me i don't know mimi kisijui sijui mimi sijui kama aliwawa sijui kama ni accident hakuna mtu anajua hiyo information tunapatia watu hiyo ndio tulipewa jumi tulipigiwa simu tukiwa kwa mlima mimi baba tena anaambia ati hana ebusi mama kidogo na muuliza ni nini ati kuna namba inanipigia hapa unaijua njua napiga na amenipigia kutoka sijui saa ngapi nikamwambia Maybe it's your fan where she goes to Kenya and asema ukisikia ni tuna kusumbua you just know then anasema hey sasa ati chira jana alikuwa ati alikuwa alisema aje alisema ati alikuwa aligogwa na boda kapas boda yenye hata ukianguka kwa barabara hata ugwaruzi hadi mikono ni kichwa peke yake unagogwa nje kichwa peke yake Ule gumu aje kichwa peke yake. Sasa shusho yake kai. Shusho yake hadi ameitwa confirm body. Amekata. Niambia atakuwa wapi? Na he was the only son. Na chira alikuwa na nyota. Like me I saw nilikuwa ninampigia simu na muongelesha. Akikuwa na stress na mwambia do this and this. Akisikia ameboeka anamwambia tuingie tu live tu chill. Like hapana na kila time akinipigia simu alikuwa anambia babes nakupenda na mwambie nakupenda pia na story inaishi hapo mimi the, the square mucho kukua na yeye ilikuwa bad yangu nimepiga simu yake the first thing nimefika kwa nyumba nikapiga simu yake nimefika kwa nyumba nikapiga simu yake three times hakuna mtu anashika iko mtinja mimi nika ignore so then nikafika hapa niko zile za Mtu akanitumia hiyo picha. Mimi niliona kwa mogo. So hapo ndo stress kanishika. Alafu unajua ukiwa na watu huwezi kuko na stress. So that time nilikuwa peke tulikuwa almost kila mtu. Tulikuwa tumejaa hivi. So sasa nafika kwa nyumba ina ni heat. Then but ni, but nimemwambia so mimi I just say like Kai. Hello good people. Karibuni sana. Guys, eh I hope umesikiza huyo ni Hana Benta hapo anaongea with a lot of pain. Guys yani it's sure or it's true. Yani haijurikani kama Brian Chila ukweli alipata accident or pia uh, maybe inaweza kuwa you know aliuliwa cause yani hizi vitu zote zenye zinaambua they are not adding up cause uh, kuna huyu jamaa i witness ameongea akasema kuwa yani alienda pale kwa ile club akapata akaona chila hapo na yani ye mwenyewe akamuliza ama yani akasema anataka usaidizi A, anataka kwenda kwenda home na huyo jamaa akaona cause tu anajua chila acha wamsaidie na wakamsaidia na akapanda kwa pikipiki but ye mwenyewe amesema ile time alienda kushuka kwa pikipiki Chila unasikia yani alimwambia Chila alikuwa naomba usaidizi but akaenda akasema kuwa Chila ile time Chila alishuka kwa hiyo pikipiki alikuwa aripe sasa mimi mwenyewe nashindwa alikuwa anataka usaidizi ya pikipiki kwa ni pikipiki ya kukuwa na mingi ama alikuwa anataka usaidizi wa nini cause from my understanding um, Chila alisema anataka usaidizi but huyu jamaa amesema 
kuwa chila arigongwa na gari akitoroka ndio asiripe akitoroka ndio asiripe pikipiki so na shindwa kozari sema alimwambia nataka usaidizi alikuwa anataka usaidizi ya nini you know alikuwa anataka usaidizi kozari kwa mlevi hakujiweza ama alikuwa anataka usaidizi alipiwa pikipiki aende nyumbani ama usaidizi ilikuwa ya nini guys i hope umeona hiyo video but mimi hizo maswali zote i wish ningekuwa pale cuz ningemuuliza ningemuuliza yani chila alikuwa anataka usaidizi usaidizi ya nini cuz yani haieleweki and let me tell you guys it's so sad cuz pia uh, wale wenye krabu wanasema kuwa waliona chira ni mlevi sana alikuwa amelala pale yani wakamtoa nje for sure watu wa krabu pia nyinyi hamuna huruma okay mumeona mtu amelala pale ni mlevi kabisa sasa mnamfukuza aende wapi mnamfukuza aende wapi ha? na ni mlevi kabisa of which pia yeye au watu wanajua huyu ni customer wana huwa anaenda pale you know na walikuwa na malafiki hapo au malafiki kwani ni malafiki wa aina gani ukweli mnakunywa na mtu alafu mnamwacha kwa club hata kama mtu ametoa fujo most of the time naona kama mko na mtu na mnaenda naye kwa club hata akienda arewe you have to understand him yani ni pombe imemfanya akue hivyo so you have to to make sure at least mmemchukua mkamrudisha wapi nyumbani so guys yani hii ni ni yote it's not adding up it's not adding watu wenye walikuwa na yeye pale inasemekana pale kwa club alikuwa na watu, karibu mtu sita more than six people bona watu sita what hakuna mtu mwenye yani angetaka nini at least i make sure chila cuz ni mlevi zaidi ame ameenda nyumbani and najaribu kufikiria ni malafiki wa aina gani although pia mtu akilewa kila mtu anaendaga kwake but it's not fair at mlalewa na watu mpaka asubuhi mpaka hiyo saa kumi na moja, alafu anakuachanisha tu hivyo kama we ni mlevi hata huwezi jibeba au watu wa nini huyo mtu hata amesema huyo eyewitness amesema yani chila alikuwa amelewa kabisa yani hata kujibeba ilikuwa ni shida hmm? mpaka simu zake hakuwa nazo simu zilikuwa zimeibiwa Guys, na hizo simu ziko na nani? I wish to the DCI wafanye kazi yake, ifanywe investigation, nani ako na hiyo simu ya Chila? Cuz hiyo ni mwizi. Hapo ni kama kulikuwa na kitu ilikuwa brand. Cuz najaribu kuangalia simu zilikuwa na nani. Mm? Kama wao walikuwa marafiki wake, ilifikaje mpaka Chila akabaki yani hana hata simu? at that moment na inasemekana akienda kwa hiyo club alikuwa na simu mm. just remember chira kuna niko na video zake akiwa rife jana okay bona alienda rife hiyo uh, juzi alikuwa kwa rife alikuwa rife na nini kama yani hakuwa na simu kwa hiyo club and i don't think like chila ni mtu mwenye anaweza enda you know he's a celebrity yani ni mtu mwenye anapenda kukua hapa na pale ina inawezekanaje yani alienda alienda kwa club bila ni mtu mwenye anataka kuangalia what is happening what is going on kwa mtandao bona akaenda pale na hakuwa na simu so guys it's not adding up ukiangalia hiyo story yote yani it's not adding up guys mimi naomba tu investigation ifanyike yani tujue cuz guys yani it's really sad alafu pia kuna watu wenye wanasema <coughs> you know tiktokers pia wajifikirie cuz yani uh, tulimtupa baba mona hmm. kuna huyu juma mwingine alikuwa anaitwa kwala kwala sijui kitu kama hiyo pia yeye alipatanga tu accident tena huyu tena ni chila hmm. na unaona venye yani kwanza iko it's it's bad it's bad kama mmeona hiyo video ya chila all if you have seen that photo ya chila you know it was bad yani chila side moja yani amegongwa yani hakuna kitu imebakishwa yani saidi yote hii haiko hmm? guess and if you want to see the photo naweza ienda kuiona uh, at passive tv uko tunaikanga vitu chafu siwezi taja hiyo jina hapa cuz nitaja youtube wata wataitoa cuz nitakuwa na violate the uh, guidelines so guys uh, it's sad it's so sad when niambie kama hiyo hiyo story ya chila mario meipata do you think it's adding up huh? Venye ukijaribu tu kuishikanisha hiyo story yote hmm? kuna kitu yenye ina miss kuna kitu yenye hatujui kuna 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 kitu yenye imejificha 
guys cuz it's it's sad haieleweki so just uh, comment below uniambie what do you think guys it's sad may he rest in peace na pia shosho yake na familia yake and to all tiktokers na wale watu pia amekuwa karibu na wao na waombea tu Mungu akuwe na nyinyi wakati huu mgumu cuz you know guys it's it's a painful 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 uh, death so guys kwa na wakati mwema much love and see you in the next video bye